Hello there guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome to Survival Russia. Today we are gonna, we are gonna pitch an enormous, uh, not enormous, big army tent. I think it's for 30 persons or something like that. We're gonna pitch it right here. We're gonna pitch it with Slava there, my buddy. He's uh, here for his uh, house, the, the, the house we uh, took down during the, the winter and blah blah blah. But uh, we have the tent in the little, uh, in the little survival Russia vehicle here, because it's of course a very big tent and very heavy. So let's just get to it. But before we start, I would of course like to uh, encourage you to uh, support the channel if you if you feel like it, if you are able to, you can uh, purchase some uh, channel merchandise and so on. There'll be links in the description for that, because all help is very needed. And as I said in the past few videos, we have a. Me and Slava, we have a project coming up, a channel project that's going to be pretty darn awesome and it has something to do with this tent here, of course. There's uh, actually just one viewer complaining a little bit about the content. I don't want to mention his name, but just take it easy. You know, where's the camping? Where's all this shared knowledge? And so on. So past few videos, he's been bitching a little bit about this and that. But uh, it is what it is. This is not like... A channel set up for YouTube. This is real life, right? Right now, I cannot go camping. I have stuff to do, right, at the homestead here. So uh, just sit down and relax and take it easy, buddy. Right? <laughs> Let's get on with it. So here is the layout. We have the bag with all the joints and strings and tent pegs and stuff. Here we have the tent itself in a big bag made of uh, what appears to be the same material as the tent. Oxford, PU, blah blah blah. There will be links in the description to the tents, of course. Windows, door, and the frame. The tent we're gonna put up, or not put up, we're gonna lay it out there. Yeah, then I think I'm gonna try and make a time lapse out of this a little bit. I would, of course, like to mention that this tent, PF Beric in Yekaterinburg, Yekaterinburg, they uh, sent to me around Christmas or something like this, or January, as a present. I didn't know that they sent it to me. And uh, it was in the big city, 250 kilometers from here, and I had no idea how to get it here. But we got it here, and uh, now's the time to pitch it. So, uh, if you guys in general are interested in the tents from PF Beric, there'll be uh, links in the description. There'll most likely be a pinned comment as well to the guys in uh, North America, Canada, and in uh, the US, Russian bear market. They have uh, both imported. Uh, quite big amount of tents from PF Beric to Canada and the US so uh, check them out if you're interested in some of their in some of their products because uh, they make good stuff they make good stuff handmade no robots not made in China anything like that here we have the bags for the frame they're made for three persons you can see one handle there one in the middle and one in the end those bags yeah, they're pretty heavy I say about 40 50 kilos each or something it's not a lightweight tent by any means we have some heavy duty heavy duty tent pegs here they of course go through these feet and blah 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 i'll show you that later but i think i've been uh, covering for the beginning here what i wanted to cover actually managed to get this uh, tent up and running too guys now we just have to attach the guy lines and all that good stuff and we could of course have done that while we had the, the tent itself on the ground but we didn't 
But uh, here we have the little uh, survival Russian vehicle. Just to, to give you an idea about the size of the tent, we can actually park the gator in here if need be. You see, this camera is not so awesome in uh, low light. But let's see how it goes anyway. And this is an actual Russian army tent. It is not a lookalike or anything like that. It's an army tent. And there's a place for two stoves there. But uh, we have to crack on with it. Not too much light left. All right there, guys. So the tent is pitched. Everything is strapped down and clamped down as it's supposed to be. The, the roof is stretched out. And yeah, we, it's a few days later. We had some good rains. Everything is awesome. I just need to pound in one of these, uh, one the last tent pack here. Lots of space. These pegs here, you can see, they sit down there at the end of the, the bottom of the frame. We have a little foot. You can see there's a triangular cut out there. We just have to mount this guy here, something like that. And we have this little hammer which was supplied in the kit. It's gonna be very interesting to uh, remove those pegs again, <laughs> I'm pretty sure. But that's basically it guys. I think I'll just sign out from here. Of course, I'll do a review on the tent at some point. It was just like, yeah, pitching the tent. First impressions, super awesome, super sturdy, I'm pretty sure. So guys, please check the links in the description. Please consider supporting the channel and all that good stuff. And until next time, get out and train, get it done, do something awesome. See you in the next video, guys, and thank you very much for your time.